So welcome back. If you are just joining us for the very first time, this is Smash Book with Miracle Tissom and I am your host. If you've not subscribed to our channel, please do well to subscribe. For our returning viewers, thank you for joining us. And for our first time subscribers, you are welcome. So today we'll be talking about this book, Ogadima by Ukamaka Olisekwe. So this book opens this setting with a particular girl whose name is Ogadima. Ogadima just wrote an exam and you know she was hoping for an admission. So her neighbor suggested and her father gave her this particular man's phone number that is in the University of Onsuka, more like a lecturer in the University of Onsuka so that Ogadima can attend the school. So she was supposed to keep in touch with the man so that the man can somehow help her to get admission based on meritocracy or not mediocrity. Why Ogadima went to visit the man in the office? The man slept with her. She was not cool with it. Obviously, Ogadima was not cool with this. But however, there's this part of her that like, she will still get admission, no wahala now. And so the man kept sleeping with her. You see her coming to visit the man, the man will take advantage of her, she will go back. Like, that kind of thing kept playing now. At some point, she started feeling sick and feverish. So she told this man, and I think the man already knows what was happening to her. So he gave her money and told her to go and treat herself and not to restore her. And so she went back home. While she laid on the bed, you know, she was pacing and somehow she checked the calendar and then she saw that she was already off her monthly sister for quite a time now. I think about three weeks or three months thereabouts. While she saw this, she felt she was pregnant. And so you see her was taking a lot of things to make sure she kills this child. Finally went to remove the child. And after removing this child, she went back home. With the way she was walking and the fact that she was bleeding, her father knew that she has committed an abortion. Like his innocent 17, 16, 17 years old daughter has not only gotten pregnant, but has committed an abortion. And so the man was disappointed. And so at night, we see that when Ogadima was sleeping, he went to buy bundle of cane. He just woke up and scattered the cane on her body. Like he flogged that mess, listen, the whole cane scattered. It was very hard. The neighbors came out that night, they were knocking. Please, oh, you will kill her, oh. you know now, that kind of thing. But he did not open the door. Like he saw he was bittered. The next morning, with the evacuation pain and the beating she has received that night, all the pains were in her when the father now bundled her. Remember they stay in Canada, the father bundled her and sent her to Lagos to one stay with his sister in Lagos. Getting to Lagos, I'm not supposed to give a spoiler for this book, but I'm giving it because I want you to be hungry for this book, so you go and get this book, it's very interesting. Getting to Lagos now, her sister did a matchmaking for her and another person. I think the man is about 30 years, matchmaking the man with a 17 years old girl. You see that the man will slap her and the auntie will come and Tingozo will come and rub like the sling on the cheek and tell her, don't worry, yeah? today's angle, tomorrow he'll be happy. You will slap her or you will beat her, you say, don't worry, yeah? so she was like a punching bag. And I think at the time, he beat child out of her. So you see in this book, Ogadima, everything that was happening, even pastor even took advantage of her. He was normally not doing well in his business. They went to see a pastor. The pastor said, Ogadima is born. They left Ogadima in prayer house. And that was how this man also raped Ogadima. Like this girl went through a lot. At some point, you feel like, ah, oh, hope has come. At some point, you feel like, ah, oh, waiting. Everything that was happening, change of government affected her. And pastor affected her. Marriage affected her, like she went through a lot in this way. Everything that was happening affected Ogadima as a person. At some point, you'd be like, wait and say, not only you, not only you, all these things they happen to. Uh -uh. Like you'd be really angry when you're reading this book. Like, did you? you are not be happy reading this book, but if you know you're the kind of person that loves being emotional or you're inquisitive to know how Nigerians then were living, especially how they were treating the females then. I bet you don't want to read this book, Ogadima by Ukamaka Odisekwe. It's a nice read. You will cry, you will cry, you will cry, and you'll be wondering, waiting when this one won't end. But thank God that at least they ended well to an extent. She found her voice to some point. Even when she ran back to her father, her father drove her back to go back. Like, 
as well. So guys, if you deal to this point, I will urge you. Okay, I will see if I, I will drop a link so that you can go and get this book or Gadema and read it for yourself. It's not something I can even say everything because I don't want to give all the spoilers. But I'm urging you, Oli Sekwe Okamaka did a very good job in this book. So get a copy for yourself and you can thank me later. So guys, we have come to the end of this video. Please do well to like our video, subscribe, share to your status so that lovers of books can find us online. And I hope to see you in our next video. Do take care. Bye.